was just looking for the sports channel, Gary. Elite Smash! Hello everyone, welcome back to yet another Road to Elite Smash, and it's been a while since I've done a DLC character, it's been about a couple months. So, I would like to play another DLC character for Road to Elite Smash, so I'm going to be playing Pyro Mithra, but there's a twist. The thing is, Pyro and Mithra have a move, which is their down B, which allows them to switch between each other. And while I could easily just play through that and play through it normally, I wanted to be a little different. So for the first half of the video, we're going to be playing only Mithra, we can only play Mithra, and then halfway through we're going to switch and we're going to play Pyra. So we're going to go ahead and start off with Mithra and we'll switch into Pyra around halfway through. Hope it sounds pretty good. Ooh, we have the Ditto to start us off. Looks like we're going to be playing against Chivalrous. Alright, so just a reminder, we're only allowed to be playing Mithra. So, I think it'd be a good opportunity to talk about Mithra's moveset. So, alright, now I was using Photon Edge, which is her side B. Think of it as Sephiroth's Aqua Slash, but it can only go one direction and doesn't necessarily do that much damage. A bit of a lag spike there as well. So, in terms of the rest of her moves, uh, her frame data is pretty insane. Uh, a lot of fast moves that come out really early. Um, honestly, not that bad of a recovery. Decent vertical height. So the move I was just using, Lightning Buster, you can charge it up. It does around four to five hits, I would guess. And if you charge it up to the max, it has a lot of range and can do some pretty heavy damage. Alright, that's just what I would have done. So, what I'm trying to activate right now is something I'll explain a little bit later, but it's something only Mithra really has, as Chivalrous switches to Pyra. I'm trying to get him with that Lightning Buster. Fake him out really easily and get that first stock all the way down. Right now, we're just fishing for down air kills. Ooh, that was lucky. Unfortunately, that was not. Yeah, the down air going that direction was lucky for me as I thought I was just going to hit the straight down and Chivalrous already going with the SD. Alright, uh, we take those. Oop, got us with the down tilt. Gotta be careful. Okay. I'd rather go for Photon Edge high. Alright, come on. Ah, uh, okay. Just waiting for an opening. That's all it is. Alright. Still not there. Okay, careful. Alright, a little bit high for that. Not yet. I'm still trying to get him with that. Okay. No down here? Okay, shielded against it. I actually would have gotten hit since the uh, uh, last two hits on shield. And they're not hitting this with down here, which is pretty good. This is mostly just stalemate. And speaking of stale, that SD was kind of stale itself, but we'll take it. Alright, on to the next one. Oh, it looks like we have Mario up next. Alright. I think Mario can be a bit of a challenge sometimes, but... Again, already off to a pretty great start so far. Okay, gotta watch out for that. Okay, Lightning Buster's not gonna do too much. Nothing so far just yet. Oh. Okay, did not hit it. This is what I didn't want. Another down smash. Good up smash. Follow up. Alright. Alright, didn't spike. We're good. Photon Edge keeps him away. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I saw Mario make full contact with that dash attack, and we still beat it out. I mean, that's just DLC privilege. Okay. Okay. I did not want a Photon Edge there. I almost did, but we're fine, because Flood will just knock us back pretty far, just in the same way that that Down Smash did. Okay. 
Alright, uh, DI to the left. I need to note that. Because uh, up smash won't be the good option in that case. Okay, down tilt up smash. We're doing combos now. There's another. Uh, we had the air dodge. He just air dodged to the stage and was able to just, um, be safe. That time was what we wanted. Okay, I think I need to do something else next time. Probably go for Rumble Dust. Okay. That was lucky. I thought we were just gone there. That's exactly why I said last time we shouldn't Photon Edge. Don't hold Alp Smash as Ledge. Okay. Okay. Why are you holding up smash at the ledge? I know what you're doing. Ah, easy two frame for the punch. All right. I got a dash attack. Oh, that's another SD. We force it by jab. It's pretty interesting. Called it. Okay, let's keep it going for this one. Already off to a pretty good start with Mithra. I have not shown all of her moves though. There are some moves that I haven't shown yet, but I've been making good use with the ones I have used so far. <laughs> You've seen um, I'm able to do lots of combos, Lightning Buster, and a couple more, just like Chroma Dust. You can use that as kind of an edge guarding tool. And then there's a that special ability I'm going to talk about pretty soon. Just wants an opportunity for it. And hopefully we can get that. Alright, that was an exchange. That was an exchange. Uh, alright. I thought he was gonna be forced into a tech situation. But, uh, he uppied out of it. Alright. He wasn't charging Flood until after I was below the stage. So that's why I didn't go Photon Edge. Because I thought he was gonna charge. Alright, not long enough. Okay. Oh, I think he's caping because he expects me to go Chroma Dust, and I th think that reflects it back. I kind of just realized. Ah, I did it again. Yep, punish. I can't recover now. And now he has full flood. Okay, come on. Alright, ran into that one. Okay. Alright. We're fine, I guess. Alright, up smash not going to kill. Okay. Alright, lightning buster is not going to kill either. Chroma dust? Oh, he was just lucky. And there's that special ability I was talking about. That ability is called Foresight, and it works a little bit similarly to Bayonetta's Bats Within, who I will do on a video on at some point. But the whole point of it is if you air dodge at the moment, or spot dodge at and anyone's attacks, it'll kind of act as a perfect shield and sort of dodge. So if you're in the air, you'll dodge down, and it will allow you to regain control of the battle a lot smoother. Almost thought I was gonna force him into a tech situation again. Okay. Good air. That shield is looking pretty low. We gotta be careful. Read on the Lightning Buster. Let's go for it this time. Ah, oh, really? He made it back twice? Wow. Alright. Just another hit. He got his up smash first. Have to give it to him. I was trying to get Foresight again on that down here. That would have been very beneficial. Alright, he did not approach the way I, I expected. And he DI'd the way I did not expect. Pick up the kill, no less. Another Foresight activation. Alright, dash attack. One, two, three. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Letter one, two, three as well. Up smash. Get him again. Yeah, he seems to either jump into it or expect Echo Chroma Dust and go for Cape. I've never actually tr tr go gone for it when it goes for Cape. And he's dead. Alright. And that's going to do it for the Mithra section. Honestly, not that bad. Alright, now what we're going to do is we're now going to switch to Pyra, my better character. And we're going to be up against a 2 link for the first time. Alright. 
So for Pyro, we need to talk about Pyro's moveset. So when it comes to the animations, as you see, they are pretty much identical. But if you'll notice something, I use Flame Nova, which is one of her moves, and there's an F Smash taking it really fast. But yeah, so Flame Nova is Pyro's neutral B. It goes at a pretty circular motion, like that. You also saw me use Blazing End. It's a pretty annoying projectile to deal with, but I find ways to use it strategically, you might say. Anyways, so when it comes to Pyra, a lot of her moves are single-targeted and really focused on killing and doing lots of damage in terms of powerful damage. Whereas Mithras are not as much lighter, but they consist of more hits and they're able to combo into more moves respectively. Alright, snap the legend of prominence for both that up B. I'm going to be talking more about it later. It has some pretty decent vertical uh, recovery and can be used as a kill move and um, lots of ways to mess your opponent up like that. <laughs> you almost died at 70 from that. That's how good it is. Down smash. I consider down smash the less powerful flame nova just because it goes in that sort of circular motion that Flame Nova does, but Flame Nova does a lot more damage on shield, as you'll see. I'll even try to see if I can pick up a shield break with it, but I don't know. They don't really shield that much, or well, if they do, they, um, after their shield gets really low, they stop after a while. They do learn their lesson, but it depends. There's another Prominence Revolt. Almost got him with the up air to catch him. It's a pretty wide range. And that up smash carrying them a lot. It may hit a few times, but it is really focused on that power. Down airs again. Spot dodges this time to read the grab. I have the bomb. Okay. He did not choose to follow up. Blazing M beats out the boomerang. It's our special boomerang. And cancels his boomerang again. He jumps. Down air gonna send him that way. Alright. Alright, he parried that. Not bad. Just want to approach safely. Alright. Huh? Uh, Alright. I guess down smash at the ledge really does work. <laughs> Good use of down smash, Pyra. Do I seriously have to deal with Ness? My god. Well, hopefully it won't be that bad. We're playing Pyra, not Mithra, so... I'd say it's a lot easier than if I had to play Mithra, because I would just be getting launched all over the place. But no matter. Hopefully this Ness is pretty stupid, as most of them are. Thinking he could get that on me, that's pretty stupid himself. Thinking he could jab block me, no he can't. Thinking he can win, yeah, of course he can't. Look at that shield damage. That's insane. I've seen it all, man. You can't fool me. Alright, Nair. I uh, drifted in a little bit. Fur, fur. <laughs> okay. All right. Ah, uh, okay. I thought he was gonna forward throw me. I was at the ledge, but I guess decent mix up, I guess. Or he really just doesn't know what he's doing. All right, good multi jab. All right, another down smash. Uh, I figured he was gonna snap the ledge, but it just didn't work out. Good forward air. That's also really good forward air, by the way. Covers a lot of distance. Okay, let's throw him forward. Him with another multi jab. Almost. Nair's gonna catch him though. Interesting that we got a kill with Nair. I don't think we're gonna be doing that as much. You're going for the same stuff every time, man. Good up smash to read the air dodge. I meant to go the other way. Blazing on doing some pretty good damage. Down air. Alright. Still not gonna hit us. Heavy shield damage. Okay. That yo-yo scared me for a minute. I thought we were dead. It's not holding at the ledge. Cancel it with the sword. That is not going to force me into a tech situation. I wonder if this will work. It doesn't. I did not attack with Mithra. Challenge is not over. Let's swat back. Go for a down air. Up air maybe? 
Oh, alright. You're just gonna go for forward air, I know it. Stop trying to be like, oh, I'm doing something unique. Down smash is just gonna kill you. Alright. Alright, guess that bonked me. Alright. Good. I can't do footstool combos with Blazing End, I'm sorry. I know you can do them with Blazing End. That's something you can do. But I have not lapped that, unfortunately. And that was a pretty close call. If he had reflected that, that could have been pretty bad for me. Oh, come on. That would have been good, too. He bounced up and just barely avoided dying to F-Smash. Maybe he'll die to something more interesting. Alright. Downer into up air? Nope. Oh! Alright, he's not dead from dash attack. That was close, though. Not down smash, either. Ooh, okay. Remember, we're on our last stock. He just kept on oh, yelling. no. Woo, baby! That's what I like to see. Beating out the yo-yo with our own up B. It's going pretty well so far. Are they really going to have me face Richter and Ness back-to-back? -back? And this is three minutes on... Is that green green? Oh, this is not going to be fun. Well, who knows? Maybe we'll find a way around it. We have our own projectiles, so if he wants to play that game, I'm all for it, I guess. But this is just not a fun rule set. Please do not make your friends suffer this. Alright, let's turn this around. Good up smash to start. Let's just try and go for down air kills. I won't let him. Blazing end. Into the F smash. Oh, yes it is. That's a fast kill already. And you know what? I think let's just let him try to camp us out. Let's go to the other side. Come on. Why don't you see if you can approach me instead of trying to camp me out. Oh, there you go. Oh, sorry. I'm over here. I'm shielding. And you're dead. Come on. Come on. You, you, you chose this stage. You chose this rule set. Let's see you adapt. I can't do anything. I'm in a f***ing wheelchair! I got hepatitis C! I can't bounce around or do my magic or even make jokes! I can't even turn into the devil's knife! My life is misery! Misery! It's pointless! Pointless! But on the bright side, at least I got this wheelchair and the wheel's broken. What happens when your opponent does nothing? I don't know. Oh. Okay. Ooh, apples. Hang on, I gotta go get some apples. Just after I burn them to a crisp, then I can make some apple pie. Yoink! Apple! <laughs> There's another apple. I'm gonna throw it at you. Did I hit him with the apple? I don't think so. Apple! No, I missed the apple. Ooh, nice back air. Flips you up, too. Just like I'm about to flip you with this apple. Oh, I missed it again. I've only hit it with one apple so far. Eh, we'll take that. It's the only kill you're gonna get, though. Look at that up here. Gonna get another one. Or if not. Dash attack will. Almost kill. Alright. Warrior's gonna finish up the job. And we just have about one minute left. You can't get me out, Richter. I'm up, up 2-1. not gonna work plus if he wants to go for camping we could just switch it up and you know go back to standing still he can't do anything about that a dash attack flame nova didn't work the way i expected but we're good another up smash okay about 30 seconds left and we are just doing very fine almost He's just trying to go for up B kills. It's not going to work. I'm at 45. I'm a heavy. You can't kill me. Ooh. Actually, pretty good DI. I thought you would die from back here. He'll die from this, though. Actually, no. Let's see if we can kill him in the next 10 seconds. He's at 149. Of course we can. Good job, forward air. All right, let's get some apples. Give me the apple. I have to throw you the apple at you. No. I wonder who won that one. It was me. Alright, only one more left. Let's play my rule set this time. 
so you can't camp me out. We're on the pirate ship stage. I like this one. Alright. Still trying to go down here. Shtick. I won't take it. Alright, come on. Nair. Up air. Down smash. Blazing end. Last hit. F smash. Woo! Woo! -hoo! Woo! You see this? Alright. That was pretty good. Alright. Oh, he missed the ledge. That was 30 seconds. I wonder if he's gonna SD. Alright. Holy water, I guess. Oh, never mind. <laughs> ah, he SD'd. Alright. Guess we win. Woo! That was a pretty good Elite Smash run. You know, being able to play a character with just, you know, there was a lot more to Pirate Mithra than uh, a lot of people would expect. Uh, I like the challenge I did, you know, many people when playing Pirate Mithra, they just switch between strong um, and heavy hits to fast, faster but weaker hits. That's essentially what they do. But with me, I wanted to sort of show what it would be like if you had the teamwork separated. Meaning that, you know, the first half, they're going to go into the more combo-oriented and focused moves. And then the second half comes in with a big and very strong hits. So, that's basically what I was trying to achieve. And having the them kind of, you know, work separately, but at the same time together is exactly what I was going for, and achieving Elite Smash is was the end goal, and I'm glad I got it. Well, get, thank you guys so much for watching, and be sure to leave a like down below, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one, and until then, peace out, and make it a great day, everyone.